at 6 o'clock, a Houstonian is being held in Vietnam after a protest in Ho Chi Minh City where more than 100 people were arrested. Will Wynn has been studying at the University of Singapore. Tonight, a family friend is begging for his safe return. Channel 2's Jonathan Martinez joins us live with his story tonight. Jonathan? As friends of William Wynn tell us they were shocked to hear what happened and are worried about his safety, now they just want him home. They tell us Wynn is a Yale graduate who grew up and lives in Houston and was currently studying abroad, working on getting his master's in Singapore. They go on to say the 32-year-old was recently visiting Vietnam and was demonstrating in an anti-Chinese government protest earlier this week, even documenting things along the way through pictures on his Twitter account. His friends say the protests started out peaceful but then turned violent. They say Wynn was approached by police beaten and dragged before being thrown into prison where he remains. Now his family, along with close friends, are working to get him released. They're holding up as good as can be, you know, given the situation. Um, currently, his sister's in D.C. Uh, trying to bring, the atten bring attention to the issue with our state legislators and the State Department to secure his release back home. And we did get a statement from the State Department just a short time ago. It reads in part, quote, we are deeply concerned by reports that William Wynn was injured on June the 10th. His safety and the safety of all U.S. citizens is of the utmost concern to the United States. The Vietnamese government permitted counselor access to Mr. Wynn on June the 15th. We will continue to push for continued and regular access by counselor officers to Mr. Wynn in the interest of ensuring due process and fair treatment. We, of course, will stay on top of this story and bring you any updates both on air and online. For now, we are reporting live from downtown. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.